what's up everyone it's been a while since I uh, made a video it's a Sunday afternoon and I'm gonna see if I can hit all of the canopy roads in Tallahassee it shouldn't be too hard to do we're on one now Old Bainbridge Road. Okay, we like the canopy roads because they are nice and shady. And down here, especially in the summer, which probably right now feels like summer to would feel like somewhere to people who live in other parts of the country. It's still spring. Um, yeah, in the summertime, it's like a 30, 30 degree difference potentially between the asphalt and the sun and the asphalt and the shade. Yeah, so we rode down to Mexico Beach yesterday and back. Um, so that was a long time, long ride. These bars are going to have to take some getting used to. I don't know that it's as comfortable for long distances as it used to be with the lower bars. It sure is a lot more fun to push in the corners. Yeah, so I uh, took off the stock CB1100 bars and put on bars from the CB900F, which was the 919 in the United States and I believe the Hornet overseas. And I mean, you can still see these are kind of upswept and but they're more narrow and they're lower and um, got these Vans Colt grips so that's fun um, that's my uh, wind catcher from Cherokee Gotta get a new feather for it though. One of them fell out. Um, that's the Gyra Shield. And then I got different fenders, but. But yeah, so uh, that ride yesterday, yeah, I could tell <laughs> way more, I was way more tired than I normally am on a ride. And that was my first long ride on these bars. Um, but man, if you're ripping around. 
around town or ripping around the mountains. I haven't taken them up there yet, but this is going to be fun. Well, they are fun. Just need to get me a long haul bike, I guess. We are still on Old Namers Road, although at some point it switches over to uh, Macomb, probably right in here somewhere. And oh, still Old Bainbridge. After it switches to Macomb, after a while it becomes railroad. 